Hi, I'm Federico Mondelli. You may remind me as the songwriter of such bands as Be The Wolf, Volturian and of course Frozen Crown. I'm often being asked how can I be so prolific and how can I manage to write so many different songs in so many different styles. But the question I receive more frequently is how can I learn to write a song? First, let's start from the basics. What actually defines a song? A song is something you can sing along anytime without any accompanying instrument. Or maybe just with a piano or an acoustic guitar. I am the There was no drums, no bass, there was no band, but still you managed to recognize a song, even if it was played in a bluesy swing version. So what makes a song an actual song? Yeah, you're right, vocal lines. Vocal lines are really what define a song most of the time, unless specific cases where an instrumental part actually managed to become more iconic than vocal lines themselves. Why am I insisting so much on vocal lines? Well, if any of you guys has ever been in a band, you'll definitely be familiar with this kind of scene happening in a rehearsal room. Hi guys, I wrote a new song. I'm looking forward to make you listen to it because it's amazing. It's something so cool and fresh, I think that it will be the hit of our new album, I'm sure. Because, you know, it's something really fresh, really fresh and brilliant. So it goes like this. Then, before the chorus, there is another amazing part. And the chorus, the chorus goes like this. What do you think? I think it's a smash hit. Something new, something different. Wait, 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 man, man, wait, 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 wait. I, I get that's the guitar part, but what about the vocals? Just sing something over it, you know, it's your job. No, no, you, you, you didn't write a song, you didn't write anything, you know, that's not writing a song, that's not a song, that's just a bunch of random guitar riffs and even very bad, if you ask me, that's not even close to be a song. And the, yeah, just sing something over it attitude is actually what makes a lot of bands around really suck. Now, how do I actually write a vocal line and where do I start to write a song? Before we go on, please keep in mind out there, there's plenty of professionals who are much more skilled and qualified. This is just my own way. I'm just a random guy who loves to write songs and I'm here to share with you my own method. Oh, if you like this t-shirt I'm wearing, be sure to check our official store, frozencrown.vcartel.com for a lot of exclusive merchandise. Let's take I am the tyrant, for example. Ci stanno ancora un sacco di persone che mi chiedono dove ho preso sta maschera. Cioè dove la possono trovare? Si è fatta di carta pesta. I had this idea in my mind of an evil lord marching, you know, with his army. So I had this kind of melody going in my mind, like pam 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 something you know along the lines of uh, the seven dwarves going to mines but more dramatic you know less happy sounding i thought this was perfect to be a chorus i usually record vocal lines on my cell phone because strangely enough they come to my mind when i'm moving when i'm you know outside walking around <laughs> So, melody again, after the vocal lines, there's the main lead guitar melody. You know, the catchy guitar hook people usually sing along at live shows. So, I had this melody in my mind being played by a trumpet or a war horn or something. Now, 
I wanted the verses to have a kind of dramatic tension. So I just stuck on the D minor chord. <laughs> in this case is our main chord or just like some people that actually studied music would say the root chord Allora la casa root come vuoi chiamarla home puoi dire tonica e la tonica si chiama nei nomi diciamo dello studio dell'armonia tradizionale però se proprio vuoi dire i nomi un po' più blandi più da non ho studiato allora di eh, l'accordo costruito sul So can you hear how sad and dramatic this chord is? <musica> After all that sadness and drama, we needed some sort of opening. So there we go with... The pre-chorus is actually Jade Entrance. In this specific case, the pre-chorus was actually used to open the song. To give some brighter vibes, you know, bright, shiny, just like Jade is. So, to suggest an opening after a monotonous part seeking the D minor, we use this chord. Which, in this case, since we are in the key of D minor, is B flat. You see? Can you hear how sunny, how brighter it is if compared with the dark and dramatic D minor? Now, after this chord, I most of the time use this one as a link between the two. So, you see what I'm doing here? I'm creating some sort of cycle. Sì, comunque il Mi è il primo grado, la prima, chiamala come vuoi. Il Do è la sua sesta minore, Re è la settima minore, Mi di nuovo la prima. is widely used in different keys in a lot of very popular songs. It's really a bread and butter combination. In this specific case, for example, I had in mind Manowar and their song Brothers of Metal. And this is pretty funny because when I play I Am The Tyrant live, I usually risk to sing the wrong chorus for the glory. question I'm asked is if lyrics are actually written before or after the melody. Well, lyrics are usually the last part because of course it may be harder to actually adapt a melody to some already written lyrics. I mean, when I write melodies, I don't want anything to actually limit me. Now, what about I am the tyrant lyrics? I usually start from a basic idea. It's easier to write lyrics if you start from a concept. Now, the concept behind I am the tyrant was the following. As you know, Jade is the main singer of the band, but in this specific song, I was stealing her place, singing the main vocal leads while she was doing the backing vocals. So I wanted the lyrics to express this as well. I am the tyrant, the evil guy who actually chains her in a dungeon, steals her throne and sings in her place. And here you can see how the lyrics and the music video went hand by hand. Now, as I was filming the part about the lyrics, I just realized it would have taken literally ages to explain the whole thing, especially because the explanation I just did doesn't solve some mysteries. If I have imprisoned Jade, why am I in the same dungeon in the second part of the video? And why is her sitting on the throne and wearing the mask in the end? What happened? So, since there's a lot to talk about, and I am the tyrant lyrics are one of the most important chapters in our lore, I just decided to make another video in the future to focus on all this. So if you enjoyed this video and you think you could be interested into a new one completely focused on lyrics, just let us know in a comment below. Well, now it's time for the last words. See you next time. No, but again, this was... All right. So... Eh? Eh? What are you saying?
how has it been to, to film this video, to play the part of, a, of the guitar player? It was very touching for me because that kind of scene happened to me so many times in my life. Yes, yeah, cool. Eh, no, perché questa la, visto, fa, mi sono messo la giacca, no? Sì. Per far vedere che è una parte dopo, in realtà è sempre. Certo. Eh. Sai, la parte dove uno si mette la giacca, cioè che se, si vede che siamo uh, in un'altra situazione, sì. no? Capito? Yes. Per far sì. credere che come fanno quelle. Cioè praticamente nei film. Sì. Dove fanno le scene quelle con tanti, tante persone sì. insieme e una donna diciamo, no? Cioè, no, ok, tanto metto i beep, oppure fanno delle cose spinte mm. di un certo tipo, cioè delle cose che sono molto, diciamo, estreme, come posso sì. dire? Praticamente alla fine fanno questa sorta di, tra virgolette, intervista sul divano dove c'è la donna tutta <ride> sorridente, così, che dice, per far vedere, capito, no? Che... Che non, non hanno... Sì, 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 non cioè, sono che non... stati... Sì, che nessuno è stato ferito, esatto. diciamo, durante... Esatto, no animals have been harmed. Esatto, è esatto. la stessa, stessa cosa. If you like this video, let us know with a comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And of course, hit the bell. Okay. Don't forget to follow Frozen Crown on Facebook, Instagram and visit our official store frozencrown.bigcartel.com for our exclusive merchandise, t-shirts, vinyls, whatever. And of course to pre-order our latest album Winterbane which is going to be out April 23. Oh and be sure to check our latest single which is Towards the Sun out now on all the digital stores. Aspetta, <laughs> something new, something different.